It has been too long since last I played. Um, well, since last I recorded playing. We're Christmassy time now, so happy holidays. They have a little Christmas deal calendar that's going on every day. There's something special. Uh, today's deal is Blackstone instead of money, and you can buy some Imperial Uncommon and Rare Orbs, it looks like. Yep. Um, I don't need those, so I'm not going to do that. There's also a Pestilian quest going on. There's also a Battle Pass now that exists. So there's all kinds of stuff. But we're not here for that. We're here for the Orcses! Right? That's what we're here for? Um, true to my word... Uh, you'll see that, like, my other guys are bronze, silver, gold, you know, silver, gold, iron, bronze, iron. My orcs is, is neglected because I didn't do anything to them. I don't remember if we had Tank Smasher last time. But um, I have done almost nothing to these guys. You'll see that uh, poor old Snotflaga is still sitting here in stone, too. And uh, nothing for abilities. Uh, Gibba Scraps is sitting here in iron, too, again. Uh, have not been upgrading him. Uh, Snapareka has got tons of shards and is sitting right here in Iron 2. Tank Smasher, not tons of shards. And then the big bossman is in Iron 3, verging on bronze. And we're going to go ahead and give him uh, a, a, a legendary combat knife. Oh no, I've upgraded somebody. And so now, magically... I must be going into, and you can have this epic, and you are rare. Do I want to promote you to epic? I think I do. I want to get you epic? We'll see. All right, so when I go on this, we're going to get our energy back, and then we're going to go into the campaign um, and start beating some face. So let's get into our Octarius. Oh, there's elite campaigns now that are even harder. I have not played Octarius since we last left off. So let's see where we are. Fighting these dudes. We're probably going to get our butt handed to us, and then we're going to have to go and apply some upgrades to our orcs. But let's see. For the war! Right, we still ain't found that Hellbreaker. That kid can't hide from us forever. <laughs> I forget what voice I used for Gibba Scraps. We needs to look in new places. Don't you think I know that? Boys, go and stretch your legs. Find me that temper's git. I do remember the voice I used for Snapareka. Okay. Um, I also think since the last time we played, uh, Gibba Scrap's tank no longer spawns and moves. Um, and so, let me see. One, two, three, four. Yeah, let's see if we can do this. All right, I'm gonna... Gibba Scraps will not be in range, but that's fine. Wah! Yep, see, he's not going to be in range to do his job. Alright, so far it seems like we're strong enough to take on these dudes. Um, You come here and smash. Boom! You smash. Boom! And you stab this guy in the face. Ah, and he's dead. These over tempos keep getting in the way! Bring me your boss, you gits! That's right. Bring me your boss, you gits. That was uh, easier than I thought it would be. I know that this is the page where things can start getting hard, and then on the last page, they get kind of ridiculous. So now that we've done that, let's just go through here. Um, give you a battle scar. And then, do we want to promote you? Yeah. All right, let's see. Oh, I got to go to my inventory to see how many. Um, how many orbs I have. Because I don't know how many orbs I have. You want a battle scar too? There you go. Tank smasher, you got nothing going on. What is this? Oh, I need to make some razor sharp spikes. And then boss man. I need more of these for the guy I'm upgrading, but you can have it for now. Okay, so your equipment is the best. Your equipment is the best that you can have. Your equipment is not the best. You can have a rare. Your equipment is the best. Technically not the best, because I've got this level 5 greaves that you can use. Um, 
and Snot Flaga, just in case you're around, you can have a rare. Okay, Snot is gonna die a lot, um, but we can upgrade the crap out of him. Let's go back to campaign. I'm avoiding claiming the energy yet because we got two more battles we can do. It's nice that I need a lot of these upgrades. So this is gonna be another two faction, well, I guess three faction battle, two enemy factions. Maybe that Hellbreak is in the mountain. Sure got a lot of tempers there. And a whole lot of them needs to. Kill them all! Kill them all! Exterminate. Alright. I know that you're not going to last. Um, I want Tank Smasher over here, I guess. I kind of want the boss to go down in and get stuck in. So let's do that. Alright. So, boss, you come here and boom, boom. And we didn't get a flea. Darn. Um, you're going to summon a tank. Boom. And you're going to smash this guy in the face. And you're going to st stay in the back because you're going to die. Um, I do kind of want to kill these tempas. So, kill this one. There you go. And then you hide in the back. Let's see how that works for us. Oh, Tank Smasher, you done got wrecked, fool. Let's do this and crush him. Good job. Um, summon a grot right here. Boop. <laughs> and you, uh, let's see, I got boss right here. There we go. That's nice. You kill him. And you kill him. And we win! Hooray! Three Star Lightning victory. If and you like that killing them nids, they seem to like... <laughs> Man, I hate this. If and you like killing them nids, they seem like they keep making more. The nids sure do like to reproduce. This is a thing. Alright. Definitely our tank smasher is on the weaker side. Because he, uh, he don't have them upgrades. So let's go ahead and give him more health. More health. More damage. Oh! Mmm. I don't know about that. So, the character I'm currently working on finishing off is this guy. His name is Volk. He's cool. And I have all of his upgrades um, already full, except for this one. And I do need these adamantine lumps for him. Um, I don't think I'm going to have enough to, to get him done today, though. The problem is I still need eight more Oh, I need one more here. So if I need one there and six here, that would make seven total if I use the adamantine lump on Tank Smasher. So I guess we can do that. There we go. And then we would need a bunch of uh, stuff for that. All right, let's do the next battle. Ooh, roses. Lots of Ripper Swarms. Fun stuff. So our Tank Smasher is a little bit stronger now. He'll get a little bit stronger than that. The nids! They coming at us from both sides! They must have followed us here, too. All the better. Come get your deaths, you gits! I got them right here! That's right. I got your deaths. Uh, Tank Smasher does three hits. You do four. But we really want the tank to summon. Um, you can shoot dudes. So I think boss... Yeah, okay. You're going to need to just summon Grots, because uh, we need Grots. So, all the Grots are going to do is soak up some shots. That's their their whole purpose in life, because they're pretty dang weak. Hit this guy. Oh, you did not kill him. That is unfortunate. Um, you can't get to him, but you can come here and kill that. Come here. Put your tank down. There we go. Now I can come over here and shoot this guy to death. Okay, let's see. Snot Flog is probably going to die. Uh, oh, he didn't die. Okay. Um, Gibba Scraps is on fire. That's probably not ideal. I don't want you to stab people. So you come back here. You stab people. There you go. Snot Flogga, kill this guy. Snap a Rekka, shoot that guy. Um, and then Tank Smash. Uh, I honestly, I don't want to put you in the fire to get shot, but I guess that's all we got. 
Um, who can you charge? You can charge anybody? No, you can just charge forward. That's not helpful. All right, this is where. It yep, it's not Flaga dies. That's what I thought. It's time for Dawa. Dawa! Smash, smash, smash! All right, so we did not get our um, lightning victory this time, but that's okay. We're doing our job. Yeah, you don't stand a chance against us, reverse worms. Okay, I do see. Oh, nuts! We ran out of needs! Well, for now. Um. If I replay this battle, I definitely know I don't need to focus the Ripper Swarms. They're not strong. They barely deal any damage to us. So I definitely need to, to take out the Space Marines first. All right, we're now out of energy. So we're going to go to our main home. We're going to gain a power level, increase our energy, get a free refill, get another requisition scroll. And we managed to fill out a battle pass mission. So we killed enemies with ranged attacks. Now it's going to make us kill melee attacks. Da, da da This battle pass just came out a couple days ago. Just like three days ago, something like that. Yeah, it runs for 35 days. So it's only been, it hasn't even been four full days yet. Um, and I'm already on 18 out of 20 on dealing damage. If you're in a high level arena um, and you do um, high level damage to the guild raid boss, not even the guild raid boss is as important. Um, arena is much more important because you can get a couple thousand damage every arena match and you play 20 arena matches a day. Um, so that is where most of this comes from. Now, if you're like a super whale, we have a guy in my guild who does, um, 200, 300, sometimes 400,000 damage in a guild raid, um, for him. Yeah. The only bad part is once this reaches the top, it doesn't start filling the next level. You have to claim it before it will um, start applying to the next level. Hey, I got... That's a long time ago. That has nothing to do with now. All right, let's fight... Uh, wow, Candle Auber Dudes and Chainsword Boys. Hey, and it's a chip damage. We need a chip damage for Tank Smasher. Look at all the fire! The swarmy nids are busting straight up from the ground! Now they gonna try the same with us. You know what works best against fire? More fire! That too, but I was thinking more tricksy. Like they tried to trick us. Alright, so let's see. Snotflaga, you are so weak. You need to be in the back. Um, boss, you come here. Okay. So you position here and shoot that guy. Good, you're dead. You come here, smash fire, and you, um, what's the, I forget the range on the tank. Come here and put the tank down in grass. There you go. So now, everybody's in nice and in range to get um, blasted with fire. Let's end it there. Chain swords. Oh, gosh. Okay. Um... We still want you to get up on top of this ridge. So come over here and hit the guy with a lot more hit points. There we go. You take out this guy. snap a -reka. You come blast this dude. Give me a grot. Boop. <laughs> Did nothing. Alright. Just get out of the fire. As Oh! Gibba scraps! Run away! You kill him. You kill him. You didn't kill him. Let's see what we can do with Tank Smasher here. Boom! Alright, he's dead. Oh, you fought at the wrong dude! That's not the guy you want to hit! The Tempers tried to get the Nids to fight us, right? Maybe we can get the Nids to fight them. Yeah. Dots thinking with your noodle. All right, we got chip damage, we got a crack grenade, we got a sigil of decay. I do not want to play again. That would be a waste of my energy. These are the only two bosses that I haven't beaten yet. I've been, I've taken out all the rest of the campaigns. Um, you know, fully maxed, fully maxed. I've almost fully maxed that one. I have one fight left here. I just have to get that last star right there. Um, fully maxed. And then, like I said, this one just came out. So I did the first boss haven't done this one yet it's because when you beat a boss you get a quest and um, the quests take energy 
So I don't want, uh, I have to use my energy in certain ways. I have to be ready to spend a lot of energy. We just got to keep them nids on our tail without letting them catch us. That's a great plan, boss. Wow, I completely changed your voice there, Gibba Scraps. What happens if they catch us? Like, um, nows. Then we gets to kill them all. It's a win-win. All right, not Snot Flogga. That's for sure. All right, forget the Ripper Swarms. Um, put you here. That way boss can come over here and deal some damage. All right, you shoot that guy. Boss, come over here. Bang, bang. Bang, bang. He shot me down. Bang, bang. That awful sound. Bang, bang. Why didn't you hit the Ripper Swarm? I know the Ripper Swarm isn't the strongest enemy, but still. Uh, come on, Grot Tank. You have one job, and it's to shoot the guy who takes extra damage from your damage type. Kill them all! Kill them all! You already said that. You're kind of like a one-note character there. snap a -reka. Um, the Grot Tank deals blast damage, and Ripper Swarms have the Swarm ability, which means that no matter what, no matter how much damage you deal, you can only kill one member of the five-member swarm per hit. However, blast damage ignores that, and it just gets to deal its full amount of damage all the way across. Oh, we're going to fight Imperial Guard now. Okay. Armor trim. There's a Humi town up ahead, and we still got Stanids on our tail. Let them fight it out. We got that Hellbreak Git to find. All right, let's find that Hellbreak Git. Um, you know, you go down here. There you go, because you have the best movement. Um, oh, I got to go through. All right, I don't want to kill the Imperial Guardsmen because they're really weak anyway. So I kind of positioned this incorrectly. There we go. And you put down your tank. Yeah, that's what I wanted to see. You come over here. You come over here. And then do I wa? I, I kind of want to wa, but let's not. Let's uh, shoot this guy. No fleeing. Man, I want them to run away. Oh, those guys got toasted. I knew I wasn't supposed to kill those guys first. Uh, Snappa, shoot this dude. Oh, come on, Snappa, you gotta kill these guys. It doesn't work if you leave them alive. You come up here and you... Wah! Smack! Oh, the worst possible guy to shoot. Oh, well. Boom! Okay, we are trouncing these guys. Dem nids beating dem locals to bits. Beating and eating. <laughs> oh, grot. There's a grot sealed inside Snapareka. He's a killer can. And he is cruel. All right, Citronome. I need this. This is something that I need for the next character I'm going to upgrade. So this is a really good battle for me to get three stars. Ripper swarms are easy. Easier to beat, I guess. They don't seem to deal much damage to us. These nids want to eat the entire town. <laughs> and <laughs> I'm Joey Wheeler. And we's gonna let them. Oh no, that's not nice. I thought you were a nice boy. I'm, I don't even need to worry about the guardsmen. They're not. Wow, we do like no damage. That's all right. They also do like no damage. Oh, I can't put the tank up on the top. Come over here. All right. Yeah, they they can't hurt us. They're dealing one damage at a time to us. So, snot, just get out of the way. Boop. Boop, boop. Um, I kind of still don't want Gibba Scraps in the front. Let's focus these guys down. See what we can do. Oh, yeah. Even the tank takes no damage. The The challenge here is just can we get the the guys to die um, before...
the uh, lightning victory condition is done. Two grots. Boop, boop. Those grots are gonna... Yeah, the grots will die. Oh, man, our tank is, like, super weak. <laughs> our snot flaga is, like, super weak. Um, come around here. Alright, you shoot this dude. You come here. Wah. Nope, 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 not charge. I want wah. Wah! Smack, smack! And I can't charge through my own... Uh, you can charge through your own guys, but you can't initiate the charge on your own guy. Um, that's a no-go. Good job! Way to smack that dude. Um, how do I want to handle this? Yeah, you come here and smack, smack. snap a come here and shooty, shooty. Gibba Scraps come here and stabby, stabby. Tank Smasha come here and charge. No, oh, there's a dragon thingamajig there. Man, I missed that. He could he would have just ran all the way to the end. Okay, smack, smack, shooty, and we're done. Yay! Oh, I love it when a plan comes together. That was the least intimidating level I think I've ever played. Oh, we didn't get the Citronome. I wanted the Citronome. So recently they added this guy um, down here. This Eldari faction is the one that's currently being released. Um, these guys all came through normal festival events, or Path of the Eldari events. There was a brand new type of event called the Path of the Phoenix for the release of Maugen Raw Skeletor. And um, next, the next event is going to start with the Tau Empire. Um, and then we know that this is going to be Jane Czar, and uh, she's going to be released in another Path of the Phoenix-style event. But this guy, Eldrion, huh, sounds kind of like Eldrick, um, is super good, and I love him so much. And I'm working on getting... I need to get shards for him, but you can't get shards other than through drops. Um, but I desperately want this guy to become legendary, because he has just the best ability. Every hit you do just does tons of extra damage to any guy that's two spaces away from you. All right, here we are against Octarius Battle 53. This is all just Imperial Guardsmen? Uh-oh. Shades of Fall of Cadia coming back. Hold your ground against the Tyranid threat, Guardsmen. The Emperor commands it. Sounds like we's getting some ways, boys. Wah! All right. Guardsmen are what we would in the business refer to as to weak sauce. But let's see just how to weak sauce they are. Boom, boom. Oh, that was not quite as much damage as I would have liked. Put our tank. Oh, I put it in the wrong spot. Kill this guy. There we go. And then you can go here and summon some gods. Oh! That's not adjacent. Darn it, I could have moved him to summon extra. Wow. Tickle cannons. Those are some straight up tickle cannons. Stabby, stabby. Shooty, shooty. Runny, away <laughs> Because I know that Snotflaga is the weakest guy on my squad. By the Emperor. Where did these orcs come from? You landed on a planet infested with orcs, dude. That's what Octarius is. Yay, we got a basic auxiliary core. A common upgrade that is really high drop rate. How unexpected. Ooh, blessed tab. Oh, no. Last cannons. So I didn't record any of Fall of Cadia, but I can tell you um, that Laz cannons are the worst. The absolute worst. Focus your fire on the orcs. All filthy Xenos deserve the same fate. Looks like we jumped to the front of the line, boys. First in line, first in line. Oof, throat. Brother Jaeger. Your voice is ruining my throat. Okay. Snotflogger, get in the back. Get in the back. Alright, so these guys. They have battle fatigue. Um, just like all the other ones, there's a chance that they can run away. But they have two-man team. This is like a, a, a weaker version of Swarm. Um, any single hit can only kill half of it. So you either have to have a multi-hit attack that deals tons of damage, or um, you have to hit them multiple times. 
And then they have Overwatch, which means if you move, you get shot. And on top of all that, so here if you look at it, Laz, uh, it shows a 60% pierce ratio. Laz actually has a 10% pierce ratio. Like if you look at these guys, 10% pierce. So why do these guys have 60? Well, it's because emplacement. It deals half damage in melee, and its ranged attacks deal 50% extra damage if it has not moved. And that's actually also supposed to say that it increases the pierce ratio of their Laz, but it doesn't say that anymore. It used to say that. Oh well. Anyway, yeah, these guys are um, to awfuls, and I hate them. Alright, so let's start. First thing we need to do... Oh, we deal we deal tickle damage to these guys. Um, I don't have a way to get into melee, so let's put him here. Not the guy you're supposed to shoot. Alright, are we going to be able to weather these shots? Nope. I don't want you moving. Oh, this is going to be bad. It's going to be real bad. Yep. Alright, you gotta just keep plugging away at these guys. Now, because they fired, I don't have to worry about Overwatch anymore, and I can go forward and shoot those guys. Yep. Oh, Tank Smasha is dead. The Smasha has died. Alright, you shoot him. Good job. He's dead. He's dead. Um, I don't want to walk on the spikes with Gibba Scrap, so you step back. Alright. These guys are dead now. I think I got this. Oh, you were supposed to move. Now I gotta waste a turn doing that. There we go. Oh, that was great. I like those crits. Those are some tasty crits. Ooh, nice. I feel bad. If I had done it a little bit different, I could get three on that. Now let's take this Humi hideout, oh dares. Oh, this Humi hideout, oh dares. To pieces. Let's take this human hideout of theirs to pieces. Let's take this to pieces? I don't quite grasp what that means. Unless it means we're gonna, like, break it into pieces. Oh, more Laz cannons. These Laz cannons are gonna be the death of me. Literally. Black Templars, let us take the battle to the Orcs. Drive these foul Xenos from this land. Starting to think you don't like us, boys. That Tempest thinks we's a bigger threat than those nids. Let's show him why he ain't wrong. Oh, you're the best boss. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. I know from reading past players' encounters with... um the later levels, like I'm talking the next page, these Laz cannons get ridiculous. Like you start having to to tank them like crazy. Put you down. Nope, that is not the guy I wanted you to shoot. Can you tank a shot from a Laz? Oof, not well. Almost killed it. Um, I can get two grots? Oh, three grots! Because there's two sides of the dude. Alright, do I bring Tank Smasher up? I guess I do. There we go. Alright! We got rid of one of the guns. Oh! Okay, so Tanky Boy... You shoot him. Did not get a flea on that guy. You take out this guy. You. Oh, man, that felt good. I think Gibba Scraps might die here. Yeah, you just run back. Oh, Smasha. There we go. Look at me. You know what I am? I am healed. Put you right there. Whoa, smash! Good job. The Xenos have breached the gates. Is it, these are the gates, I guess? And that's the entrance right there, that pit? Stop them in the Emperor's name. 
How about you come stop us, Brother Jaeger? He said, probably gonna get his butt whooped in the first time he fights Brother Jaeger boss fight. Couple more fights, and then we're gonna be beating your face in. Ugh, more Laz Cannons. Me no likey the Laz Cannons. Laz Cannons hurt my faces. No, 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 no. Yep, okay. I'm gonna have to check that in a second. Excellent work. We have them right where we want them. We got gods on the one side and tempers on the two side. Thanks. <clears throat> Thanks, Yumi. Wow, I still can't say it. Yumi's this beats chasing you down. That's right. I have lost the ability to do the orc voice. Yuse just runs right to us. Oh, God. Okay. Um, me no likey. Tank Smasher. I want Snappa to kill this and Tank Smasher to run in and get up on him. I want to put that down. That leaves Sna um, Snotflogger here to just get his butt whooped. He is going to get the whooping. Oh, you fired the wrong way again. Why you do that? Oh, so close. If I do this charge, it does get to shoot me before I get there. So I don't know that there's a... I mean, the charge will mean I take him out and I get adjacent to him. But I'm going to get shot twice, so I want boss to come first. You get shot. There we go. And now you can charge in and get into melee with that guy. And you can run away. One day I'll get you to the point where you can contribute. Oh my gosh. Oh, Snapareka died. Yep. Alright, give us scraps. Stab him. Um, Let's see. You kill that cannon. Oh yes! That's the best result I could ever hope for. Whoa! Smash, smash. Good job. Oh, that's so much better. Go ahead and put a grot down. Soak that shot. Oh yeah. You kill him. You kill him. Nope. Okay, you kill him. My guys can't kill anybody anymore. <laughs> They're all too weak. Stab. Um, one, two, three, four. You can't get to him. No, snot flogger gonna die. Get in front of him. There you go. Ha ha ha! Smash. Shoot. Fire. Ha! Crit. Keep sending them in. We'll keep killing them. <coughs> wow. Man, my throat is killing me. I can see where we just need some upgrades on some dudes. What I've been told is to finish this campaign and get all the stars. You want boss at silver and everybody else at bronze. These guys are almost at bronze. All three of these guys are almost at bronze. I don't really need him as much, but I guess I should get him up there too. And then boss needs to go up to bronze and then all through bronze to silver. So he's going to be a project for the next page. But all of them can be promoted. Like, I have 90 Xenos legendary orbs. Like, I could promote the boss right now twice. Um, and then, like I said, Snapper Reco. Oh, that's right. We were going to check how many epic Xenos orbs we had. So we're going to come here. We're going to go to Ascension. We're going to go down to our orbs. I have 54, so I do have enough to do so. Uh, why are you glowing? Okay. You were, you were throwing me off here because you were glowing. Um, so I could get you to epic. Um, I can definitely get you uh, to rare and get you an extra item because uh, I already was here and I forgot. I've got 46 for the rare. Um, and then you're already rare and I already know I have enough that I could potentially promote you to epic but I don't really like Snotflogger very much. He does have a ton of health when you upgrade him. That I can tell. Um, I fought a couple Snotfloggers in Arena and uh, they do a lot of damage to me. Uh, not damage to me, I'm sorry. They take a lot of damage. They sit there and just tank my shots. Alright, so we're going to give you the special Killy Stick Bombs. 
And uh, in this case, um, a fully upgraded uncommon is a little bit better than a not upgraded rare. Uh, so I'm just going to leave that on for now, and then we can give you a rare special killy slugga as your weapon. Um, and then we're going to up dude. Up dude? Where are you now? Uh, wait a second. Yeah, I need 130. And I have 100. So he's so close to being able to go up again. Um, I'm going to promote him because, one, promoting him costs me nothing. There's no orbs involved in this. And each time, uh, you can see that we get extra damage and health and armor. And so it's just free numbers. Uh, oh, we got the last one of those that we would need. Great. We'll come back to you. Uh, I'm not sure about upgrading their abilities yet. Some of these badges, because we had um, the Eldari released, and now the next one is Tau, and they're both Xenos, you're in need of a lot of badges for Xenos. And so you have to kind of pick and choose where you're going to spend your badges for upgrades. Um, you can go much further in the, in the game using just the um, upgrade ranks and getting just big numbers to, to beat campaign more so than spending a lot of um, badges on skills. So, for example, when I beat Fall of Cadia, um, my Angrax was at 8-8. Eight, eight. My uh, Volk was at, I think, 17-17. Seventeen, seventeen. Um, Archie was definitely uh, high. He's the one where you do want those abilities for a, um, other game modes. And then you'll see, like, my Harkin is still 8-8. Eight, eight. And then I didn't use Abaddon, but he's 8-9. Um, so... And then I believe I used Corodius a couple times. He's literally 1-1. One, one, and I used um, Nauseous Rotbone. He's also 1-1. One, one. Like, you don't need the abilities as much, except Archie, uh, as you need the the stats. Stats are great. Okay, so then we were going to do Snapareka. So let's promote him. And let's promote him. Let's ascend him. So now he's epic. Epic. And while he's epic, uh, we don't have an epic weapon, we don't have an epic armor, and we don't have an epic stick bombs. So we'll not do that. Now, I'm not going to take him to legendary, but I'll buy the next two promotions um, just to get him up even more. So we're getting some really strong orcses right now. We got them strong orcses! Like, I could easily make him epic. I have tons of epic orbs right now, but if you look at um, epic... Uh, ascension, you need 10 and then 15 and then 20. Um, and so you're looking at uh, 45 orbs just to get one character maxed out. So spending 10 for a character that I don't plan to max out uh, is kind of a waste. So we're just going to leave him there for now. Um, Tank Smasher can't go up and then I could spend on the boss, but I don't really feel like I need to at the moment. Already promoted him to legendary, which is already good for him. Okay. Let's finish off these last couple battles. We've upgraded some dudes. Three Laz Cannons this time. My gosh. These Laz Cannons are going to be the death of me. The only good thing we have going for us is that these um, maps are much smaller. Hold them, brothers. We must make our stand here. Go ahead and keep standing right there. Instead of hunting you, weez can just kill you. <coughs> All right. I'm going to lose that voice real soon. I've already pretty much lost that voice. Okay, we want you here so that you can hit this guy so Tank Smasher can get stuck in. Do we want Tank Smasher getting stuck in? We want Boss over there, right? All right, let's see how that works. And then give us scraps, I think, right there. Okay, so let's do... Hmm... I don't want to really move him down to put the tank up there, so I guess we'll put the tank here. Okay, there's a fight. Shoot and kill him. You come here. We'll take that shot. Oh, that was a lot of shots. Okay. Um, and then, sh boom. Ah, oh, you didn't get him. I wanted him to at least go down because he loses damage based on two-man team. He, uh, once below 50%, it cannot be healed above 50%. Um, does it lose? I thought it might lose damage, but maybe it doesn't. Um, and then, do I want you to run... I guess just to smash him. You're useless. You come here, summon some grots that'll just soak up some shots. Alright, let's see what happens. 
I need Gibba to come over here and heal boss. Ah, oh, oh, boss died. This is not going well. This is with our upgraded dudes. Uh, let's see. You're not going to kill anybody. Yeah, you're useless now. Just get out of the way. Uh, better to kill somebody and get them out of the action. He's going to die. He's going to die. Yep, there he dies. Darn it. I needed him to kind of stay alive. Um... We're gonna die. Yep, the last cannons are gonna take us out. Oh! Alright, you stand in the back. Can't... The tank grot... Uh, why do you gotta position yourself in the worst spot, tank grot? I can heal you to full every... Every turn. Alright, well, there you go. We got massacred. So, I'm going to work on upgrades for these guys, and then we will try again in the future. Until next time, bye-bye.